Hello guys, it's uh, July 7th, 2017. Um, just gonna give you an update of the garden. Um, right here, I'm actually working on the peony. Because there's like a little bit of issue with the growth. So I'm gonna take a closer look tomorrow and repot it, probably. I feel like there could be some fungus issue or something. So yeah, I'm gonna take care of that tomorrow, and then all of the bulbs are still out. Probably gonna put them away pretty soon, right there. They're all pretty dried now. Right there. Yeah, they're all pretty dried now, so I think I can put them away pretty soon. And then I transplanted the hyacinth, uh, not hyacinth. Uh, hydrangea, yes, hydrangea into this um, this ceramic pot. It's bigger, um, and there's a lot of new growth on this side of the plant, which is awesome. Um, and um, unfortunately, most of the flowers are kind of like dried and burned by the sun. So it's a little ugly, but what can I do? But yeah, there's a lot of new growth over here. Um, I kind of just want to give up on artichokes right now because they're very difficult to take care of, as you can see. Not really growing anymore. And then right here, this plant is taking off now. As you can see, it's finally climbing the net, exactly what I wanted it to do. Hopefully we'll see some flowers soon. This hydrangea is doing well too. Look at the pretty colors a lot more flowers coming up this way as well as this area um, asparagus pretty much the same um, yeah I don't see any new growth I don't think yeah um, rhubarb lots of new new plants coming up as you can see it's kind of messy but Right there, we have like a few new plants. Right there, right there, right there. And then the poppy plant is like, like all over the place. Uh, probably gonna need to adjust that, but yeah. And then here are some very tiny poppy flowers, which is ridiculous. Blueberry still growing. You can see the new growth over here. Um, potato is doing well too. It's getting bigger and bigger. I think I'm gonna pull this up next week just to see what it's look what it looks like in the soil. The strawberries are doing well too, as you can see a lot of new growth, and then it's sending out this uh, forgot the name, um, but yeah, it's uh, sending out this new plant this way, and I think there's a few that way too. Let me check. Yeah, that way too. You can see a few that way. So, that's pretty cool, I suppose. Hopefully we can get some good strawberry this year. There's one. Pretty decent. Good shape. Um, And then the... What is this? Uh, I forgot. Gosh, the name. I know the name. Dahlia, yes. Dahlia is still growing, as you can see. Right there, new growth. Um... Uh, Calla lilies right there. So you can see it's growing pretty nicely. Calla lilies. Probably different varieties though. Those and those. They they look different. Um and then as you can see the lily flowers are finally open. Um I might cut some of them to put them indoor because they smell really good. Yeah, they smell really good. Just look at the flowers. It's so pretty. I have a lot of flowers too. More than 10. So, yeah, gonna use it for indoor. And blueberries are maturing. As you can see right here, we have a blue one. Not sure if I can pick this already. Oh, I can. Let me eat it. Mmm, yeah. I love blueberries, but yeah, we have a lot more to come, and then the raspberries, 
are doing well. I actually did like a harvest yesterday and I'm gonna post a video about that after this. But yeah, the bees has been definitely helping with the raspberry pollination. Um, the fruit has been getting a lot bigger and I'll sh show you in the next video. And then the catnips are attracting bees as well as hummingbirds. Uh, I'll show you that in another video too. But yeah, catnips are going crazy with the flowers and stuff. Um, Rosemary is doing well right here. Lavender, as you can see, it's kind of growing now. There's new growth right there. Rosemary too. There's new growth. And then these other plants are pretty much the same. Not much to talk about. As for the indoor garden, um, as you can see, the peacock plant is doing very well. Lots of new growth, still more leaves. And then actually, it's uh, one of the plants is sending out another flower spike right here. This one is done flowering right here. Um, and then the orchids are doing well. Um, this one, not much has changed. And then this one, I kind of looked into it a few days ago. I think I saw like a new, new growth. Let me see if I can find it for you. So right here, you can see there's a new growth. So they're finally going to recover. Sorry, somebody called me. Anyways, so this is the new growth, um, which means this orchid is recovering pretty well. Um, the same orchid um, I divided, which is right here. Um, I think it, I might have showed you last week, but um, there's a new growth on this one too. Uh, it's hard to see with the sunlight. I'll move it over here. Right there, you can see new growth over there. Um, so yeah, this one is recovering too. Now we have two of the same orchid plants. I love to have duplicates just in case if one dies, I still have other plants. Um, other than that, the other plants are doing okay. The succulents, I transplanted this uh, snake plant into this pot and so far it looks like it's doing well. Um, this orchid right here is doing well too. Um, this new leaf is slowly opening up. Um, yeah, but this plant is doing well. And other plants right here is all pretty much the same. Um, and then I also transplanted this uh, peacock plant, this smaller one right here, into this pot. What else? Um, this orchid, as you can see, I think I mentioned it last week too, it's finally started to grow. Um, I think it's the growing season for them now. Um, and then, as you can see, this flower spike is turning yellow, so this it's this one is going to die. I think this is the eh, I think this is the oldest flower spike. It's going to die, and then this newer one is going to stay for a little bit. Um, yeah, something's going on over there though on this new flower spike. Right there, where I apply the keiki gel. Not sure what's going on. Um, and then what else? The um, Hoya plant is doing very well. As you can see, this new growth over here is taking off really quickly. And then there's another new growth on this branch. And the, overall, the plant looks very happy. Look at that, right here, new growth, and then the string of pearls are doing pretty well too, as you can see it's getting very long. Um, what else, right here the orchid, this new growth is getting a lot bigger, not sure if it's going to send out the flower though, we'll have to see, um, and then this one over here is doing very, I think, oh, the window is kind of burning the the leaf, so I have to move it away from the window for a little bit. And this one over here, the flower is getting bigger. 
as you can see. Can't wait. This one is doing pretty well too.